Welcome to Friesen's online tutorial series. My name is Catherine, and this session is a continuation of creating a two-page template. It will cover more options on how to customize your two-page template using InDesign CS4. You can see that we've started with an open two-page template that you've either created yourself or you've received from your Friesen's representative. And the first thing we're gonna add is some columns. So we're gonna go to Layout, Margin and Columns. You can choose any number of columns. I recommend four, five, and six. We just want to make sure they're consistent through the entire book and that's why we're adding them to our template. The next thing we're going to create is a character style. So we're going to click on the T tool and drag out a text box. And a character style will help us whenever we type text in a box on our layout pages is that we can just go ahead and highlight that and click on the character style that we want the text to change to. In this example, we're going to do our headlines. So we're going to type out headline and we're going to change the attributes of it. So we're going to change the font And then we're going to go ahead and we're going to change the size of our headline. And now we're going to go to character styles, which can also be found under the type menu. We're going to go to the flyout menu and you'll notice that all of our style settings are there and we just need to change the style name. And now whenever you make a headline on another page, you just click on the headline character style and it will change the font and the size. We're going to do another one. And this one will be for your body copy. And you can make them for your subheadings, your captions, any other fonts that you want on the page. So we've typed in body copy and we're going to highlight it and then we're going to choose a font and we're going to change the size. And now we're gonna go back over to our character styles window and we're gonna click on the flyout menu, new character style, and we're gonna change the style name. The next thing we're gonna create is we're gonna create a custom color. And before you create a custom color, make sure you have the Friesen's Color Swatch Book in front of you. So we're going to go up to Swatches and we're going to click on the, the Flyout menu, New Color Swatch. Now we're going to change the swatch name and we want to make sure our color type is process and our color mode is CMYK. And then we're going to enter the values for cyan, magenta, yellow, and black. Now we've created a custom color that can be applied to all of our pages. Now to save our customized two-page template, we need to delete the headline and body copy text box. And we need to go up to File, 
save as and we're saving it as a two page template but you need to change the save as type to template click on save and yes we do want to replace it now remember to make sure that the template is complete with all of your customized options before members of the yearbook staff start using it to create pages this completes our session if you have any questions, please contact your Friesen's representative.